Hey guys, this is Gospel with a test video to see how this will work because well, I just recently got back Fraps and well, oh, I guess I don't have my LC file here. Um, well, welcome to Fortune Summoners, the Secret of the Elemental Stone. So, just gonna be playing through this game a little bit. Um, I tried out the demo for the first hour of it and to say at least it was pretty enjoyable and it's only five bucks on Steam so. I mean, if you happen to see this video at the time uh, it's uploaded, then, well, you might as well get this game while it's still pretty cheap, because, I mean, I'd say for five bucks for this game, and if you enjoy games like uh, Ricketeer or Chantilly's, then I'm pretty sure you'll like this one. It's a side-scrolling platforming, uh, somewhat action hack and slash RPG, but yeah, it's pretty enjoyable. I mean, I only played the first hour, like I said, but I really like it. So, we're in the country of Scotchholm? Scotholm? I want to say Scotholm. So, it's a young girl, and it's a world of magic. Of course, why not? We cannot have worlds without magical crystals, so might as well make the best of it, right? course. Alright, let's get started here. Ah, here we go. So, town of Tonkinus, I guess. Tonkinus, that's a rather strange name for a town, but okay. And here we have Ark. And we're in our new hometown. Oh, this is our main character. This is a I'm not sure what her age is, but I want to say somewhere along the lines of eight years old or something like that. Of course! What kind of town wouldn't have that stuff, right? Huh. Just down the street. Okay. Yay! Oh, that was quick. Oh, okay. Just waiting for the old folks here. <laughs> Alright. But I want to see the... Oh, here we are. Okay. That's a new house, and it has an item uh, sign in front of it. Yeah. Open up business here. Oh, so this is your mother's old house. So, wait. Well, I... I'm not sure what the whole history is behind that, but I'll keep that in mind, I suppose. But, yeah, well, our parents are living off to be shopkeepers, and, well, yeah, that's pretty much it. And we'll learn more about what Ark is about to, uh, have for a future to unfold, if you will. Alright. I don't want to do chores. Oh, there we go. So, it's a pretty general store, more of a house, well, it kind of is a house, so, yeah. To move around, just simply use the uh, arrow keys, and then if you want to talk to people, then uh, just press X. So, there we go. Just gotta be a little careful because sometimes it can be a little slippery, but. Oh, yeah, and to jump, you just press the C button, and yeah, otherwise you'll have some trouble. But let's look around. You can also use the X button to examine something, so. There you go. Eh, sure. We'll take a look at that later, so. And, oh, so lighter here. Oh, everything you need. I mean, yeah, we got gumball machines, swords, uh, some pots, and some, such, so. Oh, and we also got a uh, plant or something. So, anyway, yeah, we can't get over there unless we jump. I like that. Oh, yeah, look at that. She's a ninja! Hmm. Alright, well. Sure, why not? Oh, it went a little there, but she just said okay. Okay, and yep, just simply go up to the door and press up. So, yeah. Just break them with your sword. You are an eight-year-old girl wielding a sword. You know, I would love to have a daughter like that. There we go. 
<laughs> and you can just, uh, yep, jump up and attack and whatnot, and to put back your sword or sheath it, just simply press the Z button again. And we can also examine some things, like the strong girl juice. Alright, and to open up your menu, which will be de demonstrated later anyways, just press the F1 button, and then you can look at your inventory. So this will permanently increase your max HP, but I'm not sure if any other party members will need that, so we'll save for later. But you know what, I might actually make um, Arc like a Super Bean or something. Well, not a Super Bean, but I don't know, just someone... Oh. A little bit like there. Um, just like kind of someone who gets all the upgrades and whatnot. And that chest up there will get there soon, so don't worry about it. There's a box in the way. Alright. Alright, I don't want to do chores though. I want to go on and play. Actually, you know what? Let's take care of that chest right now. So, let's. Uh, oh. Yeah, this is your room. You get to sleep in the attic. How special do you feel? Uh, Chocolat. A uh, stuffed bunny. You're talking to a stuffed... Well, you are a... So oh, no. I don't want to get my sword. I want to get this... Melchie chocolate. Alright. And... Oh, yes. And this here is our stash, essentially. So you can store items and draw them. You know, like the PC and Pokemon for lack of better words. Uh, Sword of Secrets? Sure, why not? Oh, oh. Well, yeah. Your vocabulary is not that great, but... Hey, we got some spare change. Why not? And some more books. The Magical Girl, Mirren Part 1 of 12? Sure. Alright, let's take a look. So, I mean, I might just kind of skip ahead and if you want to read it yourself then well you can just pause the video but I'm just kind of skimming it myself so there you go all right oh no I don't want to read it <laughs> okay and yeah nothing else so let's go on back downstairs and to the first floor like our mom wanted this too all right and this is our storage room you got it it's bigger than me! Yep. Uh, so I'll just walk up right against it, uh, like, uh, Castlevania style, if you will. And while we're here, let's break shit! Or we could break the box too, whoops. Mom, don't kill me. Oh, there we go. Nothing over there. Oh, wait, I. You know what? Let's check the cabin. Oh. Well, apparently we can uh, repeat the dialogue here, so, uh, just out of the way, because there might be some hidden stuff here, you never know. Like, I always like to check every now and then, see if there is some stuff, but no, not today. Oh, no. Yes, I'm gonna kill you, Mom. No, I'm not. <laughs> Oh, I guess you actually have to push it against the wall. You can't destroy it like I just did unintentionally, so. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's move it. Hop to it, girl. And hop. There we go. Oh, yeah, again, it can be a little bit slippery, so just be careful of that. And I'm done. Alright. Let's go, and we got some dinner cooking too. Beef stew, probably? I don't know. Sure, why not? Oh. Oh, of course, send your little daughter to get a knife for your father. Oh, well, I guess no one else can do it. My mom's too busy cooking dinner. And then Dad's busy prepping up the chop, so there we go. And sometimes you could just walk right off the screen and then just go right there. And again, slaughter some stuff. Get some copper coins. There we go. Hey, don't you like to just destroy stuff for no apparent reason? Because I do. And I don't think there's anything else, but yeah, you never know. Nope, that's it. Okay. 
Well, anyway, let's go to where we need to go in the... Whoosh! Jeez, I wish I could jump that high in real life. I mean, I can't even jump my own height, for crying out loud. I mean, I, I'm... I wouldn't say I'm the most athletic person, but... Well, I'm not even athletic. I'm, I just like to play dance games, that's all. Anyway, hello, Jimbo. Or, I don't even know what your name is. Hey, you're a little adorable customer. How would you like some candy? Uh, no. <laughs> yeah. Maybe these with my bare hands. Yeah, I'm just an ordinary eight-year-old girl who wields a sword. Nothing out of the ordinary. Right? <laughs> oh, well, we could do that. Yep, we're the... I'm Ark Plumsfield. I'm, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be Arky or Ark. I, I want to say Ark because if it was Arky, then it would have an I in it, so I just go with Ark. Of course. Alright. Uh oh. William, might as well be careful. Hey, you're one of a kind. <laughs> of course, you're only an eight-year-old girl who likes to look at weapons and go panty raiding. Or, not panty, but underwear raiding. I don't know. I actually didn't even know that, but, well, there you go. Oh, well, yeah. All I can do is swing my sword endlessly, that's it. Oh, it's getting pretty dark out. Sun setting is pretty nice. Oh, oh he's upstairs. Whoa, I'm home. Hello. Here's the knife. Now, cut up that chicken. Aww. Yep. School of Magic. Yep. So we're going to be learning magic in this game. Who would have thunk? Oh. Yeah. yeah, there are some normal classes. I mean, uh, I can't really think of a good example where they would primarily uh, teach something and then they still offer just general classes. <laughs> okay. Well, why would you eat dinner then go right to bed? I mean, wouldn't you want to wait for your food to settle in before you do that, but oh well. At least that's what I would want. Well, that's kind of false, because, well, sometimes I like to eat right before I go to sleep myself, and it could be one o'clock in the morning, so. You're gonna go to school all on your own. You're a big little girl. All right. Uh, good night, chocolate. You crazy stuffed bunny. Alright, yeah, that's the end of day one, so... Hope, I hope this um, tech demo went okay, at least, on my part. And, well, if it's good enough and it actually records the voice and everything, then, well, I might actually continue on with this Let's Play, so, I mean, I, it'll be a blind Let's Play for the most part, because I've only, again, like I said, I've only played the first hour of it, but there we go. And we'll continue on next time.